awkward because you ended your speech with, um, okay. if I can, what was it, like, fuck skiers? Fuck skiers. <laughs> so my whole speech is about skiing. Well, that sucks. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, um, although it isn't necessarily a positive thing about skiing, it's more just something that happened to me while skiing. So, right off the bat, it is possible to shorten your leg by an inch. Um, and it's probably not a good idea to ski with prior injuries. So, a little background info. I do a lot of dancing. I've danced my whole life. But with dancing, it can cause a lot of injuries, especially if you're growing up while doing it. So I've had previous injuries in my knees. And it's not recommended, really, to ski, specifically, if it's a knee problem, because skiing is bending the entire time. So, with that being said, um, I still decided to go skiing. And we went, I've been skiing before. It was typically in South Dakota though, but this time I went with my family and some family friends to Colorado to ski on, to ski on actual mountains. And I'd say I'm pretty, not, not skilled, it's not like a profession, but I, like I've, I've done like one of the most difficult roads routes, which is like a black triangle. I won't go more than that because I'm not that good. But with that being said, uh, we went skiing during spring break and I personally am completely against this, but according to colorado.com, that's the website, it's the skiing is typically, typically open until late April and that's without snow machines. But I went skiing at a resort without a snow machine spring break and the snow is already melting and something about skis is that they don't ski on dirt so i decided to go on an actual mountain an actual cliff and i might just draw it out because it's kind of hard to explain <laughs> but basically the trail curves like that so you're supposed to go that way but there was dirt right here so what i did was went that way and Whoa. fell like 12 feet off a cliff. And I landed like that on my legs because there's like holes, so it, it's hard to fall. Even though you're supposed to do that, I couldn't do that. And so I landed like this and pushed like my whole leg up. <laughs> and what happened after that was followed by, um, <laughs> I couldn't walk. And um, it was followed by a lot of money because I had to go to physical therapy for about six months. And it basically what happened was I kind of like, I'm not a doctor, I don't know, but I like tore stuff off my kneecap. So it was, it was just completely loose. And I also lodged my leg up like in my hip, I guess. So um, now I have to buy shoes that are, this shoe size is a seven and a half but this one needs about an eight or an eight and a half because I need to put a lift in my shoe now. So I guess what I'm gonna try to ask is that be careful when um, participating in snow sports and um, it is possible to shorten your leg and physical therapy is very expensive. So make sure you take care of yourself. And that is my shoe. Yeah. Making me feel bad. <laughs> 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 <laughs>